Uh, CNN chief Jeff Zucker exits over relationship with uh, a colleague, undisclosed relationship with a colleague, which uh, is an is you're not supposed to do that in Vin in corporate environments. CNN <laughs> chief Jeff Zucker resigned Wednesday after the disclosure of a sexual relationship with a top executive at the cable news network. The disclosure and his exit followed an inquiry into the scandal that led CNN to fire top anchor Chris Cuomo in December after it was revealed he helped his brother and battled New York Governor Andrew Cuomo, who was also accused of sexual harassment. As part of the investigation into Chris Cuomo's tenure at CNN, I was asked about a consensual relationship with my closest colleague, someone I have worked with for more than 20 years. I acknowledge the relationship evolved in recent years. I was required to disclose it when it began, but I didn't. I was wrong. As a result, I am resigning today, Zucker wrote in a staff memo. Zucker is 56 years old, a Harvard graduate who became the youngest producer of NBC's Today Show, went on to serve as president and CEO of NBC Universal before becoming president of CNN in 2013. That's a big job, president of CNN, or even the one previous, uh, president and CEO of NBC Universal. He oversaw all of Warner Media's sports operations, including Turner Sports and Bleacher Report. So the person he was involved in was an executive vice president and chief marketing officer at CNN, who until recently reported directly to Zucker and served as a top communication post at NBC. Zucker is divorced. I guess people are curious about his relationship status. Oh, he just What's that, Vin? I saw one of them said Cuomo There's a blew connection. the whistle. Well, I don't know right. if he blew the whistle, but it was the investigation into him that appears to have led to this. Um, the quote there looks to be from Zucker himself saying that when he was being questioned, uh, I don't know. Yeah. Well, that one, you're right. That one says he blew the whistle on Jeff Zucker. So he's like, you're going down with me. Yeah. It's, a, it's a headline. I don't know, obviously, what actually now happened here. you just here. need uh, Disaster Girl. <laughs> yeah. Oh, Disaster throw Girl, there. throw her into the meme? Uh, where does she go? No, wait. She just goes... <laughs> You get, but, but what was the right All photo? Of it. Just have CNN That's in the background. Right. No, no, I think <laughs> you need, you know, right there with the two of them sitting. She can have Cuomo's spot over there. Right yeah, here? right oh, there. She yeah. goes there. Yeah. She had something to do with it. She's right in that corner. <laughs> oh, this, that's all CNN people. There's the guy in the middle there as well. Uh, uh Lemon. Uh, yeah, I don't know, man. It's, uh, it's crazy that the, the, these, uh, rules. Like, I don't know. In the workplace, it's very specific rules because they start talking about power dynamics and influence and people getting, like, people utilizing their position uh, and and whether or not things are truly consensual. And then, so you have to disclose if you're having a, any type of relationship, I guess. You have to disclose it, right? I don't know. I've never been in these corporate environments. Yeah, but the... I've never been in these corporate The head honcho, I mean, you'd think, uh, something else must be going on. Okay. There's more to the story. Wow. Conspiracy theory going on. Yeah. I wonder the impact or effect on the day-to-day -day that it has for... You assume a, a CEO has a tremendous wanted, amount of responsibility as well. Well, I think they've wanted to go in a slightly different direction for a while. All right. So you're saying this was just the, uh, the final straw. This was any. This was a I don't know. Is he not disclosing the... I mean, he's, he said he acknowledged it. But didn't disclose the he, he didn't disclose it initially. He disclosed it now, which I guess is against the policy. I mean, you can't um, years later yeah. when there's a, a separate investigation going. I suppose. Listen, I mean, I don't. You know, it's, either way, CNN's gonna ha gonna have to get a new CEO, and the curious part will be to see uh, if there's any sort of tactical changes that come along with it. Mm.